हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू स्वीटी स्पीक्स ऑफिशियल यूट्यूब चैनल इन द प्रीवियस लेक्चर वी हैड सीन एसोसिएटिव एरेज इन केस यू मिस दैट लेक्चर आई एल शेयर दी लिंक इन डिस्क्रिप्शन प्लीज गो थ्रू दैट फर्स्ट देन कम टू दिस कोडिंग एग्जाम्पल लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड दिस कोडिंग एग्जाम्पल द फर्स्ट थिंग विच वी विल डू इज वील डिक्लेयर अ मॉड्यूल it is called as associative array example in this i am declaring an associative array the data type of my associative array is int the name of the array is fruits the data type of the index is string so string this data type is my key and int this is my value and i am also using another string called as my fruit to execute the methods then i am going to put the elements inside the associative array because if you remember in associative array until and unless you put elements the space will not be allocated so let me start putting elements in the associative array i have put five elements i am displaying the number of elements in the array then i am checking if dragon fruit exist if yes it will print dragon fruit then i am checking the first element of the array okay the first element of the array and i am displaying its value okay later on i am also trying to check the last element of the array and i'll display its value later on i am assigning this my fruit variable to dragon fruit and i am checking what is the element before dragon fruit and i am printing it finally i am deleting orange and after deleting orange i want to see how many number of elements let's run it and then we'll analyze the output so first thing which we had done is we had printed number of fruits number of fruits should be 5 so number of fruits is 5 second thing i have checked if dragon fruit exists dragon fruit is existing so i should get we have dragon fruit we have dragon fruit then i want to see which is the first element now you have to remember that in lookup table it implements uh, it is the lookup table which is implemented in associative array so lookup table is key value pair where key is of type string value is of type int and this string key will help in ordering so key is string it means the ordering will be in terms of string which is alphabetically a b c d so a will always come first even if the user is not putting it in sequence the array will take a whatever is starting with a as first element so even if uh, the user has not given apple as first element but still when you print the first element it should be apple so if you see the first fruit is apple similarly sequence wise the last fruit should be orange if you see the last fruit will be printed as orange now alphabetically what should come before dragon fruit a b c c is not there so a b C D so B will come before the dragon fruit. B is banana. So if you see before dragon fruit, banana is coming. Okay. Finally, I want to delete one element. I am deleting orange. After deleting orange, I am printing the number of elements. First it was five. Now one element should be reduced. So now the size will be four. The number of elements will be four. i hope with this example you are now able to understand associative array its key features and the functions i will recommend you first go through the video lecture on associative array then understand this lecture after that you code this example by yourself once you code it and run then you will be very clear with associative array in your mind For more such content please stay tuned to Sweetie Speaks official YouTube channel thank you